staff announcement. Patients with broken wind arriving. Right, guys, here we go. Another level. Let's see how quickly we can get this one done. I'm trying to get to the end as quickly as possible, as soon as I have been able to before. It's up to you to set up the most efficient and cost-effective hospital possible. People around here are pretty well off, so fleece them for as much dosh as you can. Remember, curing people is all very nice, but you really need the money it brings. Take these sick people to the cleaners. Mass a whopping 300,000 to complete this level. Okay, so what have we got here? So, looking at the map, we haven't got a huge amount of space, so we'll have to be uh, careful about that. Um, helipad's just here, so we're going to want the clinics near there. Um, maybe within a, a separate unit that I can build along here. Um, yeah, it looks like people have come from down here. Um, okay, so 60,000. Got to make some cash, I'm sure I shouldn't go too low. You know, cure a lot of people, so let's get going. So first of all, um, let's get a reception desk in here. Um, receptionist. Okay, you're okay, you're not great. Um, and then let's open the hospital straight away. Okay, so let's just make sure we leave enough space here. So I'm thinking, put that there, that's going to work probably quite nicely. Put code over there, GP's office straight in. Um, can't put it over there. Oh, that's a layout I've not gone for before. I'm not sure if it's a good idea either, but. I have a feeling they can't get round there, so let's, let, let's ch change that all up. Put that over there. Put that over there. One of everything. Okay. Lovely, lovely room, isn't it? Isn't it delightful? Isn't it? Okay, it needs any doctor, I'm talking of which. You're a surgeon, always need to get the surgeons in. Psychiatrist and researcher definitely need you. Um, there we are. And let's see what else we've got. Oh, another researcher and surgeon. Um, and then another psychiatrist and a cheap junior doctor. Okay, and oh, you're a cracking nurse. Um, and another great nurse, okay. Maybe we've gone a bit over overboard on the uh, staff today. Oh, you're a good handyman. Um, it's always good to get them because they change quite often and sometimes people just disappear from your list and you're always expecting to go, and go back and get them and, and they just aren't there. So let's get some research going straight away. Um, that size should do the trick. I know I'm sort of blocking that entrance but we'll move this all around once we get a bit more space. Let's get another desk in five and down there. Let's see if we can fit another desk in there. And everything there we go. So we can put it in. So we can fit a desk down there. And put a desk there. What can we do in terms of five cabinets? Yeah, excellent. Okay, let's get a couple radios. There's there in there. so everyone can get to it nice and easy. So we've got, we've got researcher, researcher, and surgeon, doctor, junior. Okay, um, let's get that junior training actually. Get some more training as soon as we have the available um, junior doctor to look to. I'm going to move that door over one. I think I can probably fit something in here. Um, try and use as much space as possible. At least initially, um, it's always a good job to try and fit in whatever you can. If everyone has a nice plot. There we go. Excellent. Lovely. Requires consultant, so you junior, go in there, sit down, you'll have a researcher, psychiatrist, 
I haven't got a consultant at all. Well, that's not going well, is it? Okay. Uh, no more doctors available. Are we sure? So I've got... No, 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 no. Ah, well that was bad, bad planning on my part then, wasn't it? You've got to be careful with the money. I've only got 47,000 still now. So general diagnosis, I think I can probably sit in yeah, it doesn't work that well, but it'd be just about okay. Um, gonna keep the cut stuff as close as possible. Zoom up so they can all get out of the way. Uh, crash trolley in the corner there. Uh, everything there. Lovely. Okay, we've got you doctors now, so you get in there. Sit down in there for a while. Stay out the way. Um, and what else do we do? We could probably get psychiatric here. Um, it's not ideal, but it will give a good amount of. I give a little corridor in here. Um, we don't really need much more than that. Maybe I can fit something smaller over here. Um, so let's see. So let's go over there. Look at each other while you're learning. What about each other? Plant well, for a nice feeling while you're being spooked out by your, by your psychiatrist. Maybe we'll move this up to one. Put that in there. And that one will be there. Lovely. Okay. I do have a psychiatrist, I believe. Um, so. Any more doctors? No more doctors. Ah, six more. Ah, excellent. You can train them in research and psychiatry. Just get some more research going for now. Um, if you're a cheap doctor, get some learning. Haven't got any surgeons yet, which is a bit of a worry, but. We'll, uh, we'll see. Maybe let's put a cardiogram in here if we can. Um, I'm going to need a star frame for too long. Um, okay. Right. Outfit. Creature of habit. One of everything. It makes it look a bit nicer. You know, it looks a bit like a real hospital having all the things in there. That's what we got. Discovered a new condition. Heaped piles. You must build a pharmacy. Okay. Alright. I'll get to that now. Maybe I'll put that here. It's a bit cramped, but I can move it out of the way later. It just means that if I get any emergencies coming, it's nice and close to the helipad over there. And speed up. Get out of the way. Excellent. Okay. Right in the middle of the room. I made that actually slightly too big, it doesn't need to be that big, but there we are. Okay, plant, bin, ultra down. Nurse in there, we only need a ward. Right, how are we doing? Let's speed it up a bit, let's put it at a normal speed. So I need a ward, I need one, some of those. Let's sort out this for research. Take it down, let's just. Fifty for cures and fifty for diagnosis. So that's good. So we've got some doctors going in there. We've got some doctors learning something. Ah, you're a consultant. I see. So you're going to be asking for a pay rise before long, too long. So let's make sure that those wage requests are on grant automatically, so I don't miss any of them. So maybe I get a ward in over here. Um, fit. I think that leaves one, two, three, four, five, six. I can probably fit in a operating theatre or something down there. I'll keep it the same length to keep it uh, a bit more attractive. Or oh, higgledy piggledy doesn't always look the best, does it? So we we'll get a bunch of beds in there. Um, yeah, we can have a bin, a couple radiators. Um, keep everyone happy. In my hospitals, everyone crams themselves in. I don't want anyone to be comfortable, please. Right, and pay your money. 
crammed in the corners. Excellent. Ah, and no, I think it's stick. Right, maybe I can put the desk over here. Excellent. So, let's get rid of that bed. Okay. Oh, killed my first patient. That's not great, is it? So there we go, so we've got we've got a little bit of money, we're doing okay. Research is on the go. Um, I've cured, you know, I've treated 50, more than 50% of my people. Okay. Um, now let's look at my money, so... My balance is obviously going down, but let's see money in, money out. Mm. Okay. Way. There we are, current balance. So we right click on it, oh, let's get that one. So we're doing okay, buying a lot of objects, building rooms. Let's see how much our staff costs are at the end of the month. So there we are, staff costs 2,000, so it's not all that bad. Uh, and here they come, all asking for uh, raises as expected. Um, okay. Let's see if there are any more. Doctor, attend to the meeting in cardio, please. Okay, you're cheap, you can get in there. Um, you're cheap and you already know some stuff. I still need some surgeons. Bit of a worry. So, have I got any surgeons yet? Oh, I do have you. Okay, maybe. I'll tell you what. I think I do have to put in there, I've got some other dogs and so, what have I got, I've got, you're learning to become a psychiatrist and a researcher, but you're already a surgeon, that would be excellent, I can train you up and you can do, you can carry on with the teaching, so I do have a surgeon, there, um, yeah, so I only have the one surgeon, but, more will come, more will come. Come on, I'll pay you, that's fine, I don't mind at all. Okay, so I haven't got all that many people in here. Let's get a few benches on the go. So we'll put a few benches down here. Bench, bench, leave a space for a drinks machine. Leave a space. Doctor required in GP's office. And some in front of there, I'll leave another space there. Everyone should be quenched on the first levels. They are a bit cold, maybe I can just fudge that up a little bit. Um, the warmth in these rooms hopefully can spill out into the corridors. So money is not that great, so let's go a little bit faster. Hundred dollars there to use the GP, excellent. Yeah, have a little knit and atta. Yep, yeah, hundred again. Okay, one of our doctors has become a has gone from a junior to a regular doctor. So we've got a broken heart, need a building, build an operating theatre. Okay, just wait a little while. What we'll do, I think we can fit one in here. I wasn't sure whether to go for it. Um, let's see, can I, maybe I can put that back one. No, we'll go for that, we'll go for that. We can put that in there. Get out of the way, Mr. Doctor. Excellent. Um, I can fit that in there. I can fit that down here. In the operating theatre, they do a hell of a lot of walking around. They kind of walk from here to there to everywhere. And I really must spend the time to work out what's the efficient way to actually lay out, lay out the uh, operating theatre. Because people walk in, they go in here, then they walk over here, they kind of have a look around. And stand around and they all kind of stand around in weird ways before actually doing the surgery so it seems to take me quite a while to actually get on with it um, but you know doctors will be doctors and they, you know, they just want to learn what's going on so, so 
So how are you getting on? So you're still not consultant, that's fine. Um, but you're learning that stuff. So what have we got? Bull pub. You have the right equipment and skills. There's one person with golf stones. Okay, yep, I'm ready. Okay. I think they're probably off to the operating theatre, aren't they? Yeah. Okay. So do we have anyone else who knows surgery yet? trying to learn something. You're researching. And once you've got that psychiatry, I might like to get you out of there, actually. Um, what else have we got? Okay. Well, you don't know anything. I don't know what you're doing standing around. So you're just standing. Oh, there no, there's not enough seats for you. Well, no need to fit because momentarily I'll be removing you over there oh well, that didn't go well we uh, got undercut by the poor guy already in the queue so let's get you out of there we don't want you to learn too much Surgery, lovely. Let's get some speed on. So we need an x ray. Hmm, we're running low on the money. So I earned a little bonus, that's lovely. Okay, you're a surgeon, you're a research assistant. So maybe you both can come in here and do a little learning. Ah, oh, yeah, everyone's going to be unhappy because what did I do? Typical Rob, I forgot their staff room. And no toilets either. Can I fit one in there? Uh, no. It's a bit disappointing. I wonder if I move... Can I move that up there? So if I move off, kick all you guys out. Do a surgeon's required in operating theatre? Back. So I'll move you up. There you are. Now the layout's not going to work, is it? Okay, that's actually probably a little bit better as it happened. There we go. Come on, which is there. Have a nice plant in the middle to brighten up the place. Probably don't need a fire extinguisher. No, you'll be fine. Okay, lovely. And now, oh, what have we got? Official invitation from Lancelot Spratt. Yes, please. Uh, that frog and bull pub is really, you know, having issues. So, fractured bones all beating each other up. Oh, I need a fracture clinic. Okay. Right, well, can I get the staff room in here quickly? So it's not a great size. Video game, TV, another couple of sofas, a couple of radiators. There you go. Um, okay. Mm. Yeah. Lovely. Steaming hot in there. No one complain, can complain about being cold in that staff room. So, Fracture Clinic. Can I put you in quickly? I know, it's an emergency, I know, it's the emergency guys, oh wow, there's four of them, okay, quick quick, um, yeah, they still need one of everything though, don't they, oh, that's not going to fit there, but it will do, okay, lovely, lovely, excellent, so, who's my best nurse, um, you, uh, your 
both are very tired. Um, okay, you'll have to do the job. Okay, yeah, earn some more money, why not? Why not? Why not? Okay, so you are a consultant researcher psychiatrist. You're going for a break. Junior researcher, so we've got surgeon. Okay, there's like virtually zero room in that staff room now. I don't see how that's going to relax anyone, but we'll... <laughs> let's, let's see. Um, yeah, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve people in there, and two people duly waiting for some more training. Tiredness level though. Research. Yeah, empty. Psychiatry, yeah, empty. Pharmacy, yeah, empty. And also the general diagnosis, so at least we got a new nurse to sort out this. 450 pop, that's not a bad price to pay for uh, just removing some uh, some tape, to what looks like toilet paper from the leg. Very comfortable looking chair as well, in they go. Slow it down, close the lid, put the bucket in front. There you go, excellent. And there we go, out comes the toilet paper. And off you go. Jeans are on your legs now. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Very nice. Okay. So we're going to have to have some doctors going to the cardio. So we managed to do that. Well, 800. That's hardly worth the effort, was it? Um, but I suppose it forced me to put in the fracture clinic. Um, might not be a bad idea to get some toilets in if I can fit them. Right. I don't really think I've got enough money to buy a new area. I can really do with some toilets. So, as much as I hate to do this, I could put them in now and here, I suppose. Okay, well, I'll put them in there. Put the door in over here. Yeah, uh, okay, that will, that will work, I suppose. I mean, it's not it's not the greatest. Four toilets, two sinks, that should do the trick, shouldn't it? Do your business. There you go. Radiator to keep warm. And the people will be much happier. Um, let's get the speed up a bit, get some more people improving. Okay. Two people in the queue here, one person in the queue here. Um, right. Where are you watching? You have to learn some more, okay. Excellent. So you're just a junior, you're a surgeon. What really do is with you learning a bit more. Right, yeah, keep studying. Because if you could get all of your training, that would be excellent. Um, consultant. Um, oh. You're tired, are you? Okay, you're just a consultant, kind of doctor, wandering around, getting stuff sorted. That's what I like. So, an x ray. Quite expensive, and I haven't had any calls for it yet, nor have I had any calls for the Slack Tom, so what I'll do is I'll just speed it up a bit. No one's suggesting that they need these places quite yet. A bit more money, 11,000 coming in. What we really need is some people to sort out this surgery. So let's see if we've got any more surgeons. No. We have to take someone out of training, I think, which is a real shame. Mm. We're doing quite well. What's you well on your way to sort this out. Okay, um, well, let's, let's take you out here to the Um, okay. I think we've got no other options than to bring you guys over here. Get changed together in the cupboard. Put that person's eyes. Okay, they're a bit bored, so maybe let's get a couple of chairs. Okay, excellent, excellent, excellent. In front 
of stuff or anything like that. Long hair. Yeah. People like to wait outside the toilets, don't they? Drinks machine. Okay. Lovely. Okay. Um, so, we need a bit more money. So I think what we'll do is we'll just uh, we'll leave it here. I'll run the game on a bit. And uh, in the next episode, we'll see how we can keep on going. Look how we're doing so far. Doing well on treating patients, but we need to cure a lot more and earn a hell of a lot more money. You know, we're only at 13,000, we need to get up to 300,000. So that's it for this episode, folks. Uh, we'll just uh, come back next time and see what we can do. See you later.